Hello everyone, how's it going? Welcome to a brand new stream of Fisher Online. I really hope guys uh, the stream quality is good. Maybe it's the internet on my phone, I don't know. I was just acting up a little bit. Now it looks fine. Uh, welcome Arianne, welcome Ramens. Wow, good to see you. Uh, it's been a while I know you've messaged, posted a comment recently of your return. I think it's a return, right? Um, Gilwin, Wooden Baser, if you guys are still listening, hello and welcome to the stream. It's so good to see all of you here. Um, I don't know if this is going to be a long stream, I'm not sure. Let's see how it goes. Uh, today we're playing Fisher Online. We're going for Big Sturge. I spent thousands and thousands of credits uh, making a ground bait. Oh my god, you know how expensive it is? I had to buy from the marketplace. I had to buy everything from the marketplace. So we made this sturgeon round bit using green mussels, mollusk pieces, chopped mussels. And we have a bunch of clams. There we go. Uh, the chat just updated for me, so I'm sorry. I kind of missed it. Uh, one baser. Hello, Jovan. Hello. Uh, a bit late. You are right on time. Well, I mean, I I guess I'm a little late. The stream was muted, apparently. How much did I miss? Not Nothing at all. I just started, guys. 12.45. I started. It's 12.48 p.m. right now. Afternoon. When base are you doing great? That's perfect. Marion, I'm fishing for Sterlitz. Two. By the way, the Huso record is 200 kg. Oh yeah, records. Uh, Sterlet, Ship Sturgeon, Huso, that sounds like a dog's name. 200 kg. I think a few weeks ago this was 350 kg or something crazy like that. And that is thus just nuts. We're going far away here to these coordinates. And, uh... You were on the PC and now you are on a laptop. Oh, you had bad news. Yes. PC's at the repair shop. It's kind of freezing randomly and unfreezing. I really hope you get it fixed. And you get it soon. You can play games. <laughs> Marion, you got a big one. Alright, all the best. With your... Where are you? You are fishing for starlets. Ah, you're in Iran because you told me the Husa record. Okay, I got my lights off right now because we're just traveling and a light for some reason has a battery life, which is, it doesn't make any sense to me. But once we get to our spot, I will turn the light on. We were, we we're going to blind the fish. The wasps spiders have reproduced. Joven, it's good to see you again. <laughs> Wasp spiders. Uh, oh no, was Bavnok streaming? I don't think he was streaming. I didn't get a notification. Hold on, let me check. I feel bad. No, Bavnok is not streaming. Usually he streams on the afternoons. And I stream at the same time. I kind of feel bad. Not until I restarted it, no worries though. Ooh, one ear free repair? That's nice. Okay, G3 to G4. Okay, let's get to this deep end here and then we are going to uh, put down the anchor. I mean, do we even need to put down the anchor? I guess so. It will drift. So how has your week been for everyone? Oh yeah, we start off chilled out on a Friday with the Fisher Online stream and then on Saturday I get the try hard mode on and uh, we go for uh, RF4. We either kick RF4's butt or we get our butts kicked. Usually it's our getting our butts kicked. <laughs> Alright, so. 
we are let's turn the light on finally at our spot here and uh oh man we are we're gonna get in trouble here so i have uh, this sturgeon ground bait that i spent thousands and thousands of credits making really hoping this works guys really hoping There we go, 19 a meter depth. That must be the deepest part I've ever done. Play Fishing Planet? Maybe next week. I got tired of Fishing Planet because... Um, just to play for 4 hours, I need to spend thousands and thousands of silver. And I can't even make that money back. I need to play for like one or two days consistently in order to make that money back. And that's just so annoying. That mechanism is really what killed it for me. Like if I want to log in for five minutes, I can't even do that. I got to buy the license. I got to buy the travel ticket and it costs so much. Um... Been a real little rough with school that PC just added fuel into the fire. I am doing well. The weather's being stubborn, it's not warming up like it's supposed to. Raining every day. It's just uh, so dreary. Let's see what people are catching stuff on right now. Vibro tail a shad. Uh, Twist Nord 2. Maybe we can try Twist Nord 2. Uh, wow. Absolutely nothing on spin fishing here. Asp. URL Troutmaster. Mayfly. Why, bro, Shad? Well, it's catfish. How? Uh, it's Easter in your country. Ooh. So, is. Like, are you guys off on the Friday? There we go, our very first fish on that's been fishing here. I don't think we get a holiday for Easter. Hey, what do we got here? Bistro! Hey, how's it going? Such a long time. Wait, I wouldn't even know if you're in RF4 because you're in another chat. How has your week been? How's life been? That is a sea bass. Yeah, sea bass. 4.9k. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. we're getting fish. We're getting fish. Uh, Evis. Hey, how's it going? Good to see you as well. Windbazer. You wish you could play any game. But it's in a repair. Okay, I think we have a fish on. Okay, nothing big, unfortunately. Uh, guess what level I am in Adam Fishing 2? Level 15. Catfish? Going. There's no catfish. No. This cannot be a catfish. They don't run like this. Well, maybe, it, maybe they do. I don't know. Uh, not playing up much of any games, Bistro, at the moment, and not having much time, to be honest. Uh, but everything is great, and I hope it is like that for you too. Oh, thank you so much, Bistro. I'm happy, even though life is busy, it's still going well for you. I miss seeing you in RF4. Um, but you know what? Life goes on, and uh, I hope it stays good for you. Uh, for me, yeah, ever since I started working last year. It's been busy, so all of my recordings, all of my streams are done on the weekend, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. Besides that, you know what? I cannot complain. Life's been good. So, uh, yeah. Marianne at the Sturge fight. Too hard now. I had a 24 kg Sturge. Damn. Rough. Yes, of course. Rough. How do you know? Wait, how do I know what? Oh, I just guessed. Level 15, damn. Are you still at the Sturder Pond? Welcome everyone to the stream. I'm so glad all, so many of you could make it. I hope you've been having a great week. 
I hope your Friday is or was great. And uh, please don't forget to hit that like button. I seem to have a Sturge on. Guys, I'm experimenting. Uh, there's a new update, right, where you can make ground bait. And I spent thousands and thousands of credits making ground baits. And let's see if that helps. If, let's see if that makes a uh, difference. 17 kg story sturgeon. Man. Why did he buff the sturge? I don't like it. You're in the cruise unit farming. And Maricarps. Uh, how are you not dying? I guess you're just going out the marketplace and buying those med kits and rat pills. Because I might need to go to the starter pond. I'm not making enough money. I think to buy... The kits. So expensive. In the marketplace. Buy noise is quite unsatisfying. Yeah, I don't like that. I don't like the snapping sound. You're just buying. Yeah, I wish um, there was a guide on how to get algae. It's, it's really annoying. It's all about RNG in the game. Oh yeah, I need to change my lure on this. Uh, let's change it to something else and see what we can get. There's an American DLC he's been working on, US. What I want to know is, is it just one map? Or is it literally like a continental map of the US and it has several lakes in it? That's what I want to know. Let's go ahead and put... And I don't know what to put. VIB Rima, whatever the heck this is. I'm gonna buy a catfish set up in R4. Okay. How many credits or silver are you thinking of spending? Or how much credits is it worth set up? I don't know, I don't find the spot as good as the other one. Gotta look at the records here. So, someone got a CRL Trout Master. I don't think I have that. We can go with a Twist Nord. I have the Twist Nord. Let's put Big Jig Head, Twist Nord 3, and uh, let's go with that. Bandit fight harder now too. What's with all these buffs? Tadus? Hey! Hello, hello, welcome to the stream. How are you doing today? I hope I pronounced your name right. I'm um, just fishing for sturgeon. Uh, made a ground bait for them. Let's see if they are any better. Oh, we're gonna get a fish. There we go. Nice. One baser, uh, are you sure you're talking about RF4? I think you're talking about Fishing Planet. Because RF4 is one of those games that is completely not true of. It's the only game, or one of the only games, that has actual fish fighting. Yes! 
Hello, hello. It's so good to see you. Oh my god. We missed you. Uh, Jovan, you're at Bilea. Tedus? I hope I pronounced your name right once again. Hello. It is going great. How about you? Wooden Baser, I completely disagree. Ooh, look at this guy. How big is this guy? Large Seasander, 12.2 kg. So I am at this spot here, G4. And it's sort of slow. I never liked this spot because it never worked. But I asked on Steam and someone said, Come here if you want hours of fight. So. Oh. What's up everyone? How's your week? Ben. Uh, is there any quests there? Starry Sturgeon. Maya? I don't even know how to catch this fish. But man, it's worth a lot of XP and money. But we're not going to go for that because I really don't know how to catch it. Has anyone in our club been active? We are finally level 6. I see a new member here. Leon. I think, Hubble Man, Hot Whisk, well, Hot Whisk came and never did anything. <laughs> Club rating, unfortunately, no one's caught any trophies here. Use a float and mayfly. Oh. Hey, DK, welcome. Hello, hello. Not many people play, yeah, I know. That's the unfortunate thing about this game. But, ooh, yes, I was asking people, um, the US DLC that's going to come out, is it like several lakes and rivers in the continental US or is it just one map? I feel like it's one map, but I'm so badly hoping that it's all of US and he has like two or three maps at least. Oh, okay, use float rod and mayfly if you want to catch Shimaya. I... I think Shemaya will be close to the shore. Oh man, it'll be one map. Well, you know what? I will still buy it and look forward to it. Don't buy Fisher online for me. Well, if you can't download it, there's no point buying it for you, right? Uh, will I be able to catch Shemaya just float fishing here? That'll be interesting. I don't even know what depth to set. And these sturge are being really annoying. Yes, I spent so much money. So much money making these sturgeon mixes. Green muscle, mosque pieces, chopped muscle. Thousands and thousands of credits because I had to buy everything from the marketplace. Muscle and mosque pieces. So I'm hoping we get some really big or good stuff here. And so far, it's just uh, nothing yet. Uh, I'm thinking of moving spots, actually. Let's do that. Let's move just a little bit to, uh, to her here. Oops. Move up here. Uh, I made the sturgeon ground bait, but the base is the sturgeon ground bait mix. I want to go sturgeon fishing, but I need bait. Yeah, I need the bait too, but I ended up buying it from the marketplace. The boat is a wreck. Oh. It's the only one where you can actually drive the boat when you have a fish on. Why does it look so beaten up? Because it's an old boat. It's an old wooden boat. I think this is good enough. Uh, let them sink. Yeah, so like, uh, how do you make baits again? So, attractants, I 
got the sturgeon mix and then i did the chopped mussels uh, i bought the mussel dip and uh, i mixed everything in a very very expensive sturgeon chop mussel models pieces green mussel All right, let's go storage. So while we wait for the storage, I'm just been fishing. Did we get a trophy storage? Trophy storage of any kind. If we still don't catch anything, guys, I am going all the way back to our regular spot, which is, I think, this is the spot I don't remember. So, uh, it's three fish so far. I'm thinking I need to cast. Cast one rod again. Maybe cast this. You know what? Maybe I didn't make this ground bait properly. I don't know. Martin, hello. Welcome to the stream. How's it going? We are fishing for Sturge. In Iran. Caspian at sea. Uh, fishing is okay. We just started. I got a uh, sea bass, 4 kg. We got a 17 kg starry Sturge. And a 12 kg Xander. It has quieted down. So I did move a little bit further down the spot. I'm hoping we can do good because I am using uh, our own made ground bait. As all the mollusk and muscle pieces. Uh, you're doing good. That is great good to hear. So who else in Fisher Online? That's Marianne. I'm hoping it's not the night time, which is the reason it's slow. Let's see. Oh, we're getting something. Yes. Doesn't look big, unfortunately. Yeah, it's not big at all. A few days ago, I went to Serbia and caught a 47 kg stellate sturge and a 20 on a 25 kg feeder. Ouch! How long did that take you? 40 minutes? Half hour? I feel like because of this ground bait addition, he's just made the game harder. Like fish bite a lot less now, and they're a lot smaller. Or maybe I just suck at the game. I don't know. <laughs> um, night is slow for storage. Okay. Well, I guess. I was chasing with my rubber boat. It took me 15 minutes or more. That's actually a pretty good time. That's pretty good. Yeah, the, the the secret is to chase the fish. Don't stand and fight it. Because it takes a lot longer then. Hey, that's a huso? No, that's a Persian sturgeon. 11 kg. Can you guys imagine? 11 kg on a 43 kg setup took me, you know, like a full minute. That's way too strong. And disappointing at the same time because I am using, again, ground baits. 
that I keep mentioning to everyone. And uh, it's just not giving us anything good right now. Well, we're going to keep going after them. Uh, you're trying to catch a Wells Albino. Because when you add his 10 kg. Wells Albino. Oh yeah, I think I released a video on that. I found a spot and it actually worked really great. In uh, France, if I remember. Yeah, I want to go fish for them again. Uh, besides that, I, I really don't know what lures to use here. People have caught biggest fish on all sorts of different lures. Twist Nord, um, the Cyclops, 9kg, 9.6kg Trophy Carp. Yeah. Oh wow, you already caught a 9.6kg Carp? Damn. Today you caught a trophy pond trout and a trophy mollusk. What? Wow. That's crazy. Congratulations. It seems people are catching trophies left and right. And I just don't get anything. So many posts about different trophies. Some guy went to Italy. And his second turbot was a trophy one. Like how the heck does that even happen? Matt. Welcome to the stream. Hello, how are, how are you doing? We're jigging. It is night time, so let's hope. Morning is close by and uh, turns off. I just wish nights in this game were shorter. Because fishing all around just sucks at night. I got a 2.3 kg sterlet. Ash Ilea. Yeah, I think I remember you, you mentioning. I got a nice sized uh, sterlet. Which is so rare. Especially with being a marker. Unless, I guess, people just do spin fishing there so no one catches any sterlet. Unless you're specifically going for them. And then, I guess, if you do. Go for them, you have a chance. A low chance. Six days ago, I got a 23kg trophy a carp. 22kg, nice, congrats. Okay, another fish. As you can see, our 52kg setup with a 43kg leader is just getting pushed here. Is this a 10kg fish? A 12, 13kg? I don't know. Caught only for 15 minutes. Caught a blue tag wild 41 kg. Nice. I mean, well, what what setup was he using? You can even catch it in like 30 seconds if you do it right. You need Avenger and uh, a legacy or whatever. When Gerard line according to it. Probably. Yeah, some guy pulled in a 52 kg um, trophy sturge. Russian sturgeon in like 15 seconds. And uh, yeah, you need the legacy rod, which is like a 99 kg something. Okay, the Venja can lock up to, I think, 99kg. And you get an, obviously, a 90kg line or whatever. Thirteen point seven kg large Xander. Man, these Xanders are both uh, 12kg and 13kg. How are our rods doing it? Any Sturge yet? No. Which model is better, huh? Yeah, he has improved over time. It's a lot better than what it used to be back in the day. I know that much. 
Oh, we got one already. Nice. Um, I caught... I mean, I got a few wild carp trophies on stream. I got two wild carps in one stream, I think. And then I got a wild carp trophy uh, in the pond and earlier stream. <laughs> you guys remember that. I don't know if I even spent 40 minutes. I think I spent half hour or less or 20 minutes. But I did not catch a blue marker. I think that's Bavnok who spent, uh, who probably caught a blue marker. Um, by the way, you're talking about Fisher Online. In real life, Xander living in the sea, yet much bigger than the fresh water brethren. Okay. I mean, I just want a trophy Xander at least. Give me a trophy C Xander. Uh, you're going to be level 16 in Adam Fishing 2. You know what, guys? I was thinking of streaming Adam Fishing 2 because I got to grind that game. But I really don't know if anyone's willing to watch. Uh, Marianne, you're having a hard time with the fish. Let me guess, it's going to be a 20 kg fish, isn't it? <laughs> um, Matt, you are close to level 26. And fish, you're online. Okay. Look at this guy. He wants to fly into the sky. You have high aims, fishy. But they all end over here. 13, 12 kg, 12.2 kg. Look consistent. 12.2, 13.7, 12.2. Very consistent, these sanders. Uh, any sturge yet? No, sad. By the way, where is your... If you enjoy the stream. I like the stream. I love you support. Thank you. Oh yeah, which reminds me. like okay let's go ahead and pin that message Bavna thank you for that idea I, I never knew you could do that in the comment in a chat on a live stream and now I keep doing that um you have 30,000 XP away from level 29 that's not Bad at all. Ooh. Ooh. Yes, finally. You're very close, Martin, to level 29. I want to be level... What is it? 34? Uh, level 34. I'm... Oh, man. I'm not even level... Th I'm not even level 32. I so badly want to go. And I just... I really want to just message wolf and i'll be like hey could you just uh get into my profile and uh, bump me up to level 34 please who knows maybe the us dlc i played so much that all of a sudden we are level 34 all right 20 kg sturge 80 kg sturge. They're a lot more powerful than they used to be, which is sad. We're using endgame stuff here. And these ground baits, I really don't think ground baits make a difference here. I didn't I'm not seeing a result. That says ground bait is better. Or maybe the difference is so small that I just don't notice it. Four oh five AM in the game right now. Doesn't seem like a big fish. Is that a regular sturgeon? Yeah, 11 kg. Man, what the heck? These sturge are so small. 17 kg sturge, 11 kg, 11 kg again. Um, a big waste of ground bait, honestly. 
I think people would like to watch a... It's still a fishing game, yes. But, I don't know, people can get bored very quickly. Because I can only do... Either float fishing for small fish or spin fishing and that's it. Uh, that's the issue. But anywho... Oh, let's see what we get. I'm over halfway full. Uh, my net is halfway full over. Uh, which sort of sucks because we're going to have to go back. Yeah, it is worth a try. Maybe next Friday I'll stream Adam Fishing 2 instead. And then the week after that I'll stream... <gasps> oh! The week after that will be uh, Ultimate Fishing 2. And I'm so... Oh man, I'm so frustrated. That Ultimate Fishing 2 game is coming out on a Monday. The demo is coming out on a Monday. And I was so pissed. Who the hell releases a game on Monday? Because everyone's at work. It's like, why? You don't want people to play your game? So, what the heck, you know? I wish it came out on a Thursday or on a weekend so that I could stream the game. I can release a video right there and then the people could find our channel. Uh, Marion, you're still fighting the fish. Eves, you're getting a 5 to 9 kg carps. What setup do you have? Do you have like a 10 kg setup now? Damn. I still have a 2 kg float. Oh, we're getting something here. When Bezer, you're talking about Adam fishing too, it's unrealistic and boring. I mean, clearly they don't understand what it's about. It's a post-apocalyptic game. Nothing about it is realistic. And it's an old game. So... <laughs> Um, it is boring. I mean, you can definitely, you know, find it boring. Because it is a slow start. But you know what? I love it. I love the environment. I love the level design. And I'm enjoying it. Can't believe it, but I've recorded my ninth episode right now. Yesterday. Which will come out this week, so... And you know what? A lot of people watched the videos. Uh, I was so surprised. I was shocked. You know, uh, I found out Adam Fishing 2. I think someone from here, from the chat, mentioned it. So I played Adam Fishing 2. And I'm like, you know what? Let's try it out. I tried it out. I released a video. And I got over 100 views within the first 24 hours. And that is rare on my channel. And I'm like, oh my god, what? How is that possible? And since then, I've been just making episodes. Um, I have AF2 installed and lasted playing AF... Oh, last you played was in March 14th. Yes, you're saying Ultimate Fishing 2? It's gonna be meh. <gasps> no! Kyber, hello, hello, welcome to the stream. How are you? How's your week been? Yeah, I finally hooked something big here. But my friend isn't the only person. I mean, I really don't care. <laughs> to each their own. On my channel, it's a different story. You see how popular it is. Uh, so I'm going to keep playing the game until I have no more content to provide. As for the stream, I'm willing to give it a shot. I'm fine with it. Uh, but my friend is... Seriously, I played at their games. So your expectations a lot. This type of publisher should talk a lot, but they don't... Oh no! I really thought they were a really good game maker. 
And I thought of that, I thought like that because people were saying it like that. And now you're saying it's not, and I'm just... Yo, that sucks. Because... <laughs> I, I mentioned this before, I never played fishing games. And whenever I did try, they were always trash. And I just never bothered with fishing games again. Right? So it's only until recently... I'm like, you know what? This game looks pretty and let's check it out. And people are like, oh yeah, we can't wait for it. It's gonna be a good game, this and that. So I took people's word for it that, okay, maybe this publisher, whoever, uh, they actually do a good job. And now, unfortunately, I had, you know, medium to high expectations. <laughs> and now I'm being told, no, lower it. Uh, which sucks. Because I was really waiting for a new fishing game. Oh man, whatever. I'm still gonna check it out. I'm still gonna play it. And let's see how it goes. So how big do you guys think this fish is? I think it's maybe a 40 kg. If I'm fortunate. He seems to be giving up already, so I think he might be just 20 kg. And... Not gonna be terrible, that's for sure. We just don't expect... Near Fisher online or anything. Oh, man. You know what, Jess? It's good to have you here. I always feel comfortable, because you know everything. In this game, in RF4, <laughs> you've helped me out a lot, so... <clears throat> uh, Martin, I guess it's a fish, not a whale. Uh, I mean, I'd love a whale. You know. <laughs> we already have this fish, really? 100 gram perch? Oh, when basic, I think you nailed it. I think it's 100 gram. <laughs> I'm not shouting at this fish. Damn it, fish. Get out of here. Marianne, you've been fighting that fish for a little while. Please be 24.9 kg large sturgeon. No, I need something bigger. <laughs> hey Jess, you'll be spitting the truth. All right, and I welcome that. <laughs> oh my God, Martin, welcome to the community. I just checked my phone and it says that you just subscribed. But thank you so much for that subscription. I'm so happy that I'm actually doing a good job uh, in convincing you to uh, subscribe with us. Um, I switched my streaming programs. Oh my god, we're getting two bites already. Oh boy. Oh boy. Uh, yeah, as I've said before. Um, I switched my streaming program to OBS Streamlabs just so whenever someone subscribes uh, we get an alert but because YouTube is absolute trash it never <laughs> it's never worked which sucks so much because I spent all that time and effort figuring out how to do this um, and I keep telling people you know what once I'm more popular once we have a big enough community I'm gonna switch over to Twitch I don't know when that will be but we will eventually go to Twitch and hopefully all of this works. Whenever someone do, uh, whenever someone subscribes, we will all be able to welcome them. Like me trolling a wolk and getting a three spoolers at a time. That is a good problem to have. And I think I have a fish. No, I think we got a bite on the other rod. But it went away. All right. So all these fish I'm catching, even if we make a thousand silver, I'm still not going to break even. We'll give you Twitch bits. Aw, thank you. I cannot wait 2,000 subscribers, guys. Oh my god. And then I think you can donate stuff or like uh, give stuff. I don't know what the YouTube equivalent is. Twitch bits. And then apparently they have this new subscription thing on YouTube. You can join the channel. 
And you get new emotes, only those people get emotes who are super chat donations, yes. Super chat donations. Uh, there's a new feature on YouTube where you can subscribe. And with the subscriptions, you unlock different things like you unlock emotes. Uh, you will get exclusive access to like never released videos that I made and that never made it to the channel. Uh, you get early access to the videos, stuff like that. So YouTube is trying to catch up to Twitch with stuff like that. Um, but again, fundamentally, if um, it's not showing your subscribers, you know, whoever joins, then that's a big issue. Let's see how it goes. Oh, we have the fish already. That was quick. Oh, we still have a fish on our other rod, but it's a, it's a little baby. Yes, what have you been playing recently? That's a Persian, isn't it? That's a mean looking surge. 19.7 kg. Uh, thank you so much for the farming sim 19 mod. You're talking about it looks really cool i really want to try oh, <laughs> okay that's what you're doing right now yeah i want to try that stuff too and i want to rp it you know um i have the idea for it i just i just wish people more people would watch because i spent a lot of time making those farming sim videos i spent hours and hours modding thinking of ideas figuring everything out and you know, I'd only get 10 views, 20 views. And that would just break my heart. My most watched farming video, I don't know how the hell it happened, uh, but it's about snow plowing, my very first episode. And I have a few hundred views on it. So YouTube decides to recommend my some of my videos to a lot of people. And a lot of, a lot of people watch it. So I just wish YouTube did that for every video. <laughs> um, Desolate, if you guys remember, you know that scary open world game? Yeah, initially, I got very little views and you know what? It's okay, whatever. But like two, three months ago, it's gotten over like two or three thousand views. So I don't know how the heck it even works. What life is even. Um, don't judge a book by its cover. Yes. Asked some time ago. Yeah, I did ask for ideas because I ran out. And you know what? This is a perfect idea. Thank you. I wish some games would make a huge collaboration to make a very realistic fishing game. Where you go home to sleep because you need it, eat and cook. Um, I can see that becoming very annoying. Uh, but the closest game to that is uh, Adam Fishing 2. You gotta eat, you have health, you have rad resistance you gotta take care of. Uh, great, only 51 coins for that 10 kg Vals Albino. Yeah, sometimes some fish are disappointing. Right, like the golden carp. You expect to get a lot of money because it's so rare. I mean, it's decent pay. I'm not going to complain. <laughs> um, it's a whale, Matt. <laughs> I hope so. <laughs> F2 doesn't have such realism like R4. Well... The only thing a good RF4 has is the fish fighting mechanism. And that's basically it. Fisher Online has better graphics, better scenery, better everything else. Um, but yeah, we do need a game. A fishing game, I guess, that does everything right. Beautiful graphics, absolutely amazing fish fighting skills. Not grindy because it's a garbage free to play game. Uh, you can own a boat, you can drive to different lakes, like so you own a vehicle, you know, but that's all talking dreams. 
So, uh, imagine we have to collapse with our foot. You know what? Um, Adam Fishing 2, I think Wolf just ditched that game because I haven't seen an update since like August 2019. I don't even know why that game is still running. I guess it's still making him money. <laughs> Wolf hates our foot. It won't happen. I mean, all Wolf needs to do is uh, upgrade the fighting mechanism, make the rods bend more, and there you go. But it's paid access also, you can't quite say RF4 isn't beautiful with scenery. It isn't. Uh, Belea looks decent, Anguska looks decent, and that's pretty much it. As opposed to Fisher Online, oh my god, there's so many maps where there's huge mountains, there's cities, you can see. It's an amazing thing what he's done. So to me, like, Fisher Online looks better than RF4. I mean, fish model wise, yes, RF4 looks better. But everything else, even water, like look, there's actual waves. Fish actually splash, my boat is making waves. Um... The only other game that might do it better in terms of water realness is uh, the other free to play game, uh, Fishing Planet. So, RF4 water is like Mercury. Yeah, it's very. I don't know, guys. They just need to put a little bit more effort, the RF4 team, and they can make a really good game. But again, I think it's the whole coding problem. The guy who coded the game, he left. And now these devs can't really do much or whatever stories I've heard from you guys. So that's kind of, I think, holding them back. Killer. Welcome, welcome. Um, your online and RF4 would be the best. Combine the best of both worlds, right? Uh, there's any difference between those three boats that we have in the game. Yes, there is a difference. So this boat, I always take this boat because it's slow. But you can put two rods in. Oh god, we're getting spooked. But this boat, you can easily drive it around. Okay, so the big boat has three rod holders. But you cannot hold a rod and drive the boat at the same time. And then the third boat is a sports boat, I, if I remember correctly. Um, I don't think that boat is in on the map, but the sports boat is the best one as well because it does have two rod holders, but you can drive it a lot faster. So, I hope I was able to explain the differences. So whenever you want, uh, if you're only fishing with two rods, uh, take the sports boat. If we're gonna get spooled, Take the sports boat. If you're not going to get spooled, so if you're going to be in Italy, your chances of getting spooled are minimal because the fish are small. Take the big boat because you can have three rods out. I hope that helps. And I might get spooled on the other rod. Um, just missed if you ever decide to show off F19 mining, mining, try the mining and construction map first. It's small and easier to show off all the stuff. Yukon is gigantic, in fact, way too big. For single player. Yeah, I was actually impressed at how good it looked. And when I was watching that video. And looking at the map. So. Let's see. Alright, Killer, I really hope I helped. Uh, I'm, I'm glad. <laughs> um, show off the mining and construction map. Uh, the mining con and construction map isn't that like in a tropical place. I know there's a map that looks really weird. It's color gradient or whatever is off. It's like really green and there's trees and that map sort of threw me off. But like I so badly wanted to make roads. Because I know there's a mod I believe uh, you throw like black tar. And you press it or something and it magically becomes a road and that's so cool. Yes, that's the map. Okay. 
Welcome everyone to the stream. Wow, 22 people watching right now. Welcome. We have another fish on our other rod. Uh, oh no, I won't be able to reel in the other fish because our bag is going to be full after this one. You have Minecraft, you can make a fishing game in that. Hey, uh, if you check out my channel, I did play Pixelmon on Minecraft and that's a Pokemon mod for Minecraft and it is absolutely amazing. You have Pokemon battles, you can ride your Pokemon, so if you have, you know, like a Dragonite, you can actually sit on your Dragonite and you can fly it around. There are Pokemon gym battles, it is insane. So I played that a long time ago, if you do want to check out the video. But fishing mod, I'm sure there's a fishing mod in Minecraft. Um, one minus AF2 that you can't have more than one rod. Yeah, you cannot have more than one rod out, which sucks because, but you know what, whatever. I haven't even made it that far out in the game, so. Uh, I might quit fighting this fish. Wow, you've been fighting for a while. No, keep fighting it. Good baser. All right, see you soon. Joe, I hope I open up. Oh man. Threaten to bite it. Oh yeah, Mary. <laughs> when basic, that's a good one. Uh so like what? Last week or the week before chess. Um as welcoming new people to our to our chat, to our stream, to our channel. And I'm like, you know what? Just uh, don't be shy, say hi, we don't bite. And Marianne's like, oh I bite. And Joan's like, yeah, my spiders bite too. <laughs> oh my god, that's so funny. And now it's a thing. Now wouldn't be such like Marianne, just trying to bite that sturge. And I'll give up. I think we almost have the fisher. Don't forget to uh, say hi in the chat, guys. Uh, if you're enjoying the stream, which I hope you are, uh, like. And if you want to keep watching more of the great stuff, please subscribe. Pokemon Jail Shower Battle. Ah, oh, man. Uh, you have three feeder setups, 23 kg rods, and I'm almost going to Finland. Is it possible to fish there with my rods? Yes, it is. Absolutely. I went to Finland with 18 kg rods. You're, you are going to catch 20, 23, 25 kg fish there, and it is a lot of fun. A whole lot of fun. And remember, Finland is all about trolling. Even if you do get a big fish on, you have your boat. You can chase the fish. Uh, so you can definitely go with 23 kg there. Uh, Marianne, a good 30 minutes I have had this damn fish. I need to eat food soon too. Oh, not till you get this fish. Ooh. Could that be a huso? No, that looks like a Persian to me. Uh, Evis, maybe we need to connect with AF2 dev. Later on, he wouldn't leave. I mean, Wolf, the guy who made this game, He's the one who made uh, Adam Fishing too, but he just stopped developing or making that game. Okay, let's see what we have here. Last up to 2019. 32.3 kg large Persian Sturge. Okay, finally I'm happy with that weight. I'm happy with that weight, but the other guys were, uh, were a disappointment. Because, again, I know I keep talking. Saying the same thing over. Oh no, the fish unhooked. Oh wow, something was spooling us and then it just unhooked. Thank you, thank you. Ezio, hi, how's it going? Um, thank you so much, guys. Yeah, I, I know I keep crying about this, but I spent thousands of silver making the sturgeon round bait. I added green mussel, mollusk pieces, chopped mussels. And I really expected us to catch big fish, big sturge because of it. I wanted to see what's the difference between using ground bait and not using ground bait. Um, Ezio, how are you doing? I hope I'm pronouncing your name right. 
Uh, your display pictures, guys, are tiny, but I see you have a... Is that a GTR? Or is that a 350Z with a kit on? Try a different spot. Yes, I'm going to try your spot. I think this is your spot, right? It's, uh, it's D9. We can go to D9 next. Let's see how much money we made. 1,157 silver. It says 125%. I don't know because of premium. I'm going to make 125% more over this or what. But almost 300 silver for this version. Uh, 200 for this large surge. Very sturge here. Cool beans. Oh, yeah. Look at our Lord Sanders. 89. Sell that. 13,000. Yeah, I think I was 17,000 at one point. Let's grab our boat. Uh oh. Is our boat going to be there? Alright. See you soon. Psychiatrist. What is your problem? Yeah, if it's under 45 kg. Yeah, half hour, that's... Yeah, I'll bite someone if that's the case too. Oh, I'm kidding. Um, Adam fishing can be a popular game, just needs updates and it will be golden. Um, it needs a lot of change. For one, the graphics throw people off. The graphics don't look good. But that doesn't bother me. Right? And there's so many other things. Like, the game is very slow in the beginning. You're using a float. You're catching small fish for the first few hours. And people are going to be like, Oh, that's boring. And they're going to leave. So, the game needs a few changes. But, I really think it can be a very good game. Because... It's a very unique game. It's you're fishing in the, a post-apocalyptic world, and you can do so many cool things with that. Uh, so, yeah, it, it's it's limitless what you can do with it. I just wish you know how it was this zombie craze, how there were like open-world zombie games like H1Z1 or whatever the hell that name of the game was, a uh, Rust, and all of these games. We need to have a game like that, open world game like that, except it's to do with fishing. Post-apocalyptic world, uh, there's food, there's hunger, um, there's people, there's cities, towns around the world where you can buy different types of rods and reels and setups. And there are radiated lakes and rivers, and it's all about fishing. It's not about violence, it's about fishing and exploring and crafting. I keep dreaming about it. It'll be so cool. <laughs> yeah. It can have a much bigger audience. You know, in Adam Fishing 2, I'm I'm so desperate right now. I'm going to use Google Translate to translate from English to Russian. Then I'm going to go on the Steam forums and I'm going to go in game and I'm going to ask people how the hell do you get algae because algae is what we need craft stuff and there it's just such an RNG thing I'm wondering if there's an actual way of farming it and then whatever those people say I'm gonna have to copy paste the Russian text and translate it back to English uh, it can be uploaded to definitely see your video I mean wolf has uh, checked out our streams from time to time only for a few minutes but you know what he has checked out our stream um so i hope he can hear me i hope <laughs> he checks the stream out sometime and he said oh you know mr is suggesting that i do this if i could at the moment i would fight someone <laughs> marion keep at it man You've already spent over half hour. Uh, let's see, what missions do we have? In Maya. The one that suggests to do float fishing. Ooh, Evis, another one. Evis, what is your rod 
that up. Do you have 10 kg rod setups? Are you bottom fishing? Tell me. After you catch the big fish. Thank you so much all of you guys. Uh, for chatting today. The chat has been amazing. There's so much to talk about. Thank you all for the likes. We are already at 16 likes for the stream. That is amazing. And uh, there are currently 18 of you watching the stream. Fish your online and not a whole lot of people watch the stream. Uh, but recently uh, I've noticed a lot more people. So that's great. Wait, wait for what? Another big one. Oh, okay, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Evis, take your time. Catch the fish and then let us know. What your setup is. Is that the Crucian Pond? Like what? A 7kg setup is the biggest you can buy? Or something? So that's what I'm wondering. And I guess you're making so much money that... Uh, you have no issue buying... The med kits and stuff. Any new subscribers? No, no new subscribers yet. Oh, guys, I am going to AFK for like 2-3 minutes. Okay, uh, give me a minute. Hopefully, I don't get spooled in that much time. Evis, Marianne, I hope you catch your fish right as I return. Uh, Jess, probably again. Jess and probably someone else is probably getting food. Thank you. I will be right back. Give me two minutes.
Oh boy. I am back. I am back. Okay. Oh, wow. We gotta go. We gotta go. <laughs> what are you guys laughing at? Huh? You guys want me to sink? Wow. Wow. So great you guys are. You're the best. <laughs> uh, Marianne, um, you got the damn fish. A good 45 minute fight. Uh, are you still fighting the fish, Marianne? I have a feeling that the boat is going to be pulled underwater. Oh my god, yes. Look at this boat, it's... Yeah. <laughs> R.I.P. Farip. We have another fish on our other rock, which is great. Alright, how big is this fish? And its pool is good. I got the fish just under 45 kg. Oh, man. That's still decent. But it's crazy how it took you, like, what, 45 minutes? Alrighty. Man, I saw Bavanok's video yesterday. I actually didn't watch the video yet. But he got another, like what, 38 kg big head at the Tuba Pond. I so badly want the Tuba Pond to be hot. Uh, because like I said, you cannot get spooled there. So I love that place, but it just hasn't been active. And I wonder if it's active now. But Bavnok does have PVA, so he can he can do really good at the pond, and I probably won't. And I have a sword throw from Shad. <laughs> oh man, that's funny. Oh uh, well, at least you can get your food now. Our other rod will not get spooled, hopefully. Very little line was taken out. Uh, this rod was, uh, what, three-fourth way out? So, this fish got a boost. Booster rod. We're shouting for 30 minutes. Damn. Someone needs anger management. <laughs> Damn it, fish. Reeling already. I gotta go. I'm hungry. Oh my god, you're so annoying. And the fish wasn't having it. Okay, we almost have this one. So I'm guessing hopefully a 20 kg. I mean, I wish I could say it was a 50, 60 kg, but even on these 40 kg setups. Man, guys, the weather, <laughs> a lot of swearing, no. And... Oh man, that's a tiny little boy. 18 kg? 21 kg, okay, sure, I'll take it. Oh my god, 44 kg Huso. That's what you got, okay. Is the rod? No. Alrighty. Uh, you have a 40 kg feeder rod. So I have 43 kg rod and reels. Uh, no. Yeah, I have 43 kg reels, but 40 kg rod. So I have a 39 uh, kg leader on it. So basically, the leader is like the weakest part. So I call them the 40 kg setups. You are now going to play Fishing Planet. Wooden base what happened? Um, I just got a fish, 21 kg fish that almost spooled us while I was AFK. And now we have this fish on. And this is probably smaller than the 20 whatever kg we had. 
Guys, the issue with playing Fishing Planet is it costs so much money to go to the map and buy an advanced license that I need to play that game for like two days just to make the money back. Or I need to play it like an entire stream's worth. And that sucks because... That sucks because like after the stream, I gotta play other games. I gotta record. I don't have time to play that game. So... Like, it's really hard for me to... You have negative 800. R.I.P. So, yeah. Like, when basically you gave up on that. And I think that's the reason... That it's just throwing me off. Like, it's a fun game. Even though the fish fighting is, you know... Disappointing. Um... I'd love to play it, but it's... It's really hard to, and... They've implemented a system like that. It's really annoying. You have 350,000. Damn. I wish you could transfer some of that. Like in Adam Fishing 2, um, some guy gave me a hundred dollars or a hundred, you know, in-game currency. And what he said was, buy something that you can trade on the marketplace. So I bought something that was like four silver. And he's like, put it on the market for a hundred silver. And I did, and he bought it. And that's how I got the money. So you can do stuff like that in Adam Fishing too. Uh oh. Uh oh. We have a spooler. We have a spooler, and I'm not even in the general area. Oh, I am in the general area. Alrighty, Abyss. You know what? The all caps is gonna blow my brains out. <laughs> I'm not gonna earn it back, I know for a fact, since I barely have any bait left. Ooh, you're gonna go for big tarpon. Uh oh. I think we're gonna get spooled really quickly there, so this fish better get its act together here. All the best with the tarpon. Tarpon yada. Oh my god, come on fish! I can't, I can't have that rod spooled. We need that fish. They can get up to 75 kg, damn. I hope I still have line on the other rod. Hurry up, hurry up, hurry up. 18 kg huso. Okay, so he didn't take too much of my line. That's good. Woo. I know the feeling getting it spooled with on two rods. Oh yeah. Uh, I have one that big. Well, Marion, you are like level 2 million in that game. It doesn't even matter what size you tell me. You could have caught 200 kg shark and it would mean nothing to me because that is so out of my league you know i've i've been catching tiny fish in that game and i'm low level so it's hard for me to comprehend <laughs> yeah you're level 60. Lost a big fish. R.I.P. Yeah, those Atlantic salmons are uh, are really scary. And even on the Alpha and the Caliber, they used to burn. So strong and OP they made them. And go for sharks to level sixty-eight. Damn. Okay, yeah, let's chase this fish. <laughs> well, hey, we took care of him. We got fish on both the rods, so. Alright, Martin, thank you so much for tuning in. Uh, I hope to see you soon. I hope you have a great rest of your Friday. 
And uh, yeah, thank you again for joining this amazing community. I'll be streaming same time tomorrow or the uh, Russian Fishing 4. Uh, bye, Martin. Avis, I got a 21 kg trophy Maricarp on the setup. Nice, congrats. Of 16. Uh, Avis, you're gonna have to tell me before you go how many kg setup you have. And is it available at the Cruisin' Pond? Man, I thought this fish was gonna give up. Evis. What rod do you have? Bottom fishing rod? How many kg is it? 8 kg? 10 kg? And did you buy it from the Crucian Pond uh, store? Man, this fish is still running. Bottom rod, I'm missing to it's 8 kg rod feeder, 10 kg reel, 8 kg line. You bought at the cruising pond. Perfect. Yeah, that's all I wanted to know. Wow, how much was that? That must have been like a thousand credits or silver, whatever the heck that is. Hey, you have your food. Okay, no more cursing, no more biting. <laughs> now that you have your food. 8 kg bottom. Wait, that's 300 silver, right? Yeah, I think this is a... Uh, this is a big one. Go run. We're using our pump technique because apparently that works. 300 XP, uh, how much radiation coins or silver, I don't know. Alrighty. See you soon, Avis. Oh, it's the... Uh, okay, 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 it's 300 uh, silver or whatever the heck it is. Got it. I gotta make a good amount of money before I can buy that. Thanks for that, Evis. That's gonna be my goal then. Where is this fish? I stop the boat to see where the thing is heading out. By the way, what are you gonna do on tomorrow or for stream? Uh, like I mentioned before, I have no idea. I'm gonna see tomorrow morning what's hot and what's not. Samuel, hey, welcome to the stream. How's it going? Uh, Evis, everything is around 800 plus. Damn it, that's very expensive. I don't think I'll ever be able to get that much money. Yeah, so when Bazer tomorrow, I'll, you know, check Discord, I'll check, uh, uh, what is it, VK? And I'll see what spots are working, what's not working. And decide on that. And I'm so happy. Uh, Samuel, you're doing good. That is great. I am doing good as well. Um, I'm happy. My weekend has already started. I am streaming. I'm enjoying. We're catching big sturgeons. 
And uh, yeah, it's going good. Thanks for asking. The only thing is though, guys, I just, the weather's crappy right now. Uh, the weather here is not warming up and it's been raining every day. And that sucks because I work outdoors. You know, it's like 12 degrees, 13 degrees max. The normal right now for us should be 16 degrees. Uh, Jess, uh, you found a mining or construction map for you. That looks realistic. All right, thank you. 800 plus or minus. Yes, I got it. Oh my god, our other rod is getting a hit. Thank you, guys. Oh man, I still need to spend a few hours in Minecraft. I need to release that episode. Um, oh god. Uh oh. Alright, I think that rod is gonna get spooled because this fish is gonna take another... I don't know, man. 10, 20 minutes. city yes thank you i have built that entire city block by block i think that city took me a thousand or plus hours i don't know i think it took me many many months to make and uh when i look back i'm amazed at how the hell i did that 300 raw 300 real 210 and by 8kg of the sh shelter it costs 100 damn Evis, that's very expensive. I don't think I'll get there. That fish will take five hours. Yeah, unfortunately, guys, this rod is going to get spooled. The one on the holster. Because uh, I've been fighting this fish for, I don't know, ten minutes now. Thank you, Jess. I hope this new city is, uh, is better. Uh, but I already sort of don't like the shader pack or whatever I have. I don't like the lighting. It sucks. And I'm just too scared to change it again because that's going to mess everything up. Line at shelter is 100. Dude, I only have like 51, you know, radiation coins or whatever the heck the currency is. So I'm never, ever, ever getting that. Am I going to do a Minecraft silver? What does that mean? Oh, server. No. Only single player. I'm going to make the city by myself. Uh, there is no other. I know. Like. Uh, it's my personal project. I don't want to do multiplayer or anything like that. I appreciate it. Thank you. Uh, Jess, don't touch it. You know, from experience. Yeah. I think I've done that before in this game and I did lose a fish. <laughs> so we're not gonna touch that other rod. You don't want us dynamited. Yes! Damn it! <laughs> That's exactly it. Oh, you know what, guys? Maybe I'll get the other fish. But this guy looks so small. Why you look so small, buddy? Don't touch the shader thing in Minecraft. Okay, I got it. Yeah... So exactly, if you've watched my new video, that's exactly what happens when you update. 30 kg large starry sturgeon. Nice. Yeah, that's exactly what happens when you upgrade the texture pack or anything of that sort. Because I upgraded the texture pack and now my buildings are poop colored. And uh, this video that I'm going to release... Oh my god, we already have a fish on? No, I think it's the ticking from this rod. WTF27, hey, how's it going? Good to see you again. I mean, it's a grind a little bit, but believe me, it's worth it in my opinion. Yeah, you know what? I appreciate it, but... It's, it's my personal thing. It's my vision, and, uh... The video I'm making right now, like, uh... You, in the video what you'll see is um you'll see the real life building okay from google maps i keep showing from time to time in the video 
and then I will show you what I'm making and I'll go through the problem solving like okay in real life the building has four windows like this and then there's a white wall how are we gonna replicate it in Minecraft hmm do I do it like this right so that's how I'm doing it and I guess maybe it might be an instructional video I'm not sure uh, but that's basically what I wanted to share and maybe someday if it's so popular I can just stream myself doing it in real time uh, I have a perfectly modded copy of Minecraft and I didn't update change it for three years because I'm afraid it will break exactly Jess I lost my entire city because of that update and the shaders and stuff and it was such a heartbreaker so that's why I had to start this new city and then I updated the the texture pack and buildings turned to poop color and now I just I disabled everything I am not updating I'm not doing anything I'm not touching this game again if you think servers are complicated or something believe me they're not really yeah I just uh, there's no need for multiplayer for me it's just my offline project I guess and you try a knee spot it is still active oh man I don't know I'll see okay I'll look into it <laughs> uh Evis 21 kg carp 47 coins damn you can buy only one med kit with that money yeah so I, I gotta spend a few hours this weekend building the building and then releasing an episode and see how it does you know is it is it are people gonna watch is it gonna be failure should i even do that do more i'll see it's it's like the first test for me dura is good that's good are you catching starlets there So 30 kg fish is our biggest one yet, I think, for today. Oh, you tried. What else is good in Sura? Uh, just try it and you will see it's worth it streaming or not. Yeah, Adam fishing too. I might stream on a Friday. But, uh... Evis, you gotta give me money, man. I need to buy the rad pills and uh, and the health kit or else I'm gonna have to go back to uh, the starter pond <laughs> I'm serious I'm not gonna live for long in that game that's the issue okay it's good to see this fish is strong yeah, I'll put something on sale on the marketplace in the auction house and then you can buy it. I don't know, like two, three hundred rad coins. Yeah. What happens when you die from radiation poisonings? I have no idea. And I'm afraid I'm going to lose all of my equipment. I really don't know. Or maybe I lose my character and all the progress. I don't think it'll be that severe, but I have a feeling we might lose all of our equipment. Can't be that bad, yes. Let's do a death stream. Mr. Dies in Adam Fishing 2 stream. And then all you hear is me weeping on stream. <laughs> Oh, Jess, did you hear that? Like, um, I was saying earlier in the stream, I'm so desperate uh, in Adam Fishing 2 that I need algae. You need algae in order to craft, I think, radiation pills and health kits. And uh, I believe you get them just randomly fishing. But I want to ask. I ask around in-game in English, no one's there. It's all only the Russian people. I'm thinking of translating using Google Translate 
and opening a topic in uh, the Steam forums. And then whenever I'm in game, I'll just copy paste English to Russian. How to get algae. And hopefully someone answers me. But then I don't think I can copy paste text from in game. Because I gotta convert it back to, to English. Watch video, beginner guide. It says what happens, I don't remember. Do you lose something? Not a lot. Okay. Thank you. You know what? I, I need to Google this now. Maybe you lose a little bit of money. <laughs> it's live leak with one of No. Hey, that's my in-game character. Oh, wow. All of a sudden, uh, we have uh, 10 people watching. Um, we dropped. All the way from... what? I think we... Hold on. What did we peak out at? 24 people? Oh, wow. 25 people, people were watching the stream at one point. Those are RF4 numbers. Thank you, Ibis. Any plans for anyone on the weekend? I know with the virus and all, we're sort of stuck at home. No idea if you can copy paste in Wolf's chat. I don't, I don't know. But maybe I'll just stick to the beam form and ask there. Because the game does not explain to you anything about radiation and dying from radiation and how to craft health kits. I was in Russian fishing for in a real life, but I was not fishing. Okay, cool. I'm sure you can just Google picture. And it probably looks exactly like that. Like, it looks like a grub or whatever. That burrow in trees and stuff. This video says you lose experience. Oh. All your experience or a little bit? Huh. That's not too bad, Ibis. It's the same as an RF4. Kind of moves weirdly, yes, of course. Yeah, it's a, it's a grub or something. Or it's similar to a grub. A lot? How exactly did it say? Oh no. Did you lose a lot? Okay, thank you. That sucks. Uh, because once you level up, you can put points in gaining more experience. You can put points in, I think, controlling the fish better. Stuff like that. Hmm. When base it out, sounds yummy. If you ever see a shaker in real life, just bump it down. Fishing planet, you have a 500 kg net. Yeah, enough with your showing off. Marianne, can you donate something to me in Fishing Planet? You probably can't. <laughs> Underneath a river, and the river had sterlets living in it. Wow. That's cool. Well, you would eat a larva because it's high in protein and other beneficial things. And it's something new, it's something interesting, right? And 427 kg rods. It's not gonna kill you. You're not that weak. Come on. Protein? I don't know, okay? Maybe, yes. Bugs have a lot of protein in them, or whatever I've heard. So, <laughs> but it doesn't kill you, makes you stronger. What do you need in uh, anor fishing when you're gonna stream? Okay. Well, how do I even message you? Are you are you on Discord?
pops when I bite and chomp on it. What kind of toxins, Papa? How do you know it has toxins in it? Evis, I don't know what that means. Oh, you don't have Discord. Okay. Damn it. Because I don't know how to communicate with you. Here, we're still waiting for my day. You know what? Once I hit a thousand subscribers, maybe then I'll... Oh boy. We're getting spooled again. Oh my god, we're getting spooled hard on that one. Maybe when I hit a thousand subscribers, I'll make my own Discord server. But honestly, we need a lot more people who are active uh, for our server to be worth it. Because if, if it's only like three guys talking on my server, Discord server, like what's the point, right? But if it's an entire community, that'll be cool. Oh, you have it, but you don't have my name. Okay, 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 okay. All right, Evis, uh, let me catch these fish and then I'll copy paste it into the chat. The Discord name. I've seen in survival shows, the guys will pull a grub out of like a tree or something and he'll put it in his mouth and he'll bite on it. You know Bear Grylls? I don't like that guy one bit. Uh, but I remember watching an ad. He just pulled out a grub, he chewed on it, and like it splurted out all that crap onto his lips and stuff. Yuck. <laughs> you know that show. Yeah, I don't like the guy. I don't like his show because it's very unrealistic. In a survival situation, you don't run like an idiot and take risks. Uh, to me, the greatest survival show ever was done by Les Dowd. He's a Canadian and he did all of the camera work by himself. He was alone in nature. And I love his shows, but unfortunately, uh, he stopped making them a long time ago. Dip in batter and roast it in butter. Oh my god, what? Gone hunting for shaffers. My biggest fishing fishing plan is 98 kg. I'm gonna be a sturgeon. <laughs> yeah, that's all I remember. He's running, he's jumping around. He's taking risks. Oh my god, that other rod is getting spooled so hard. And he suggested you drink your own that stuff. Yeah. You don't do that. That's no. Yeah, the other rod has a serious fish on. I think I've already gotten spooled on it though. Nope. I'm about to. Getting murdered by the other rod, yeah. Uh oh. I hope I don't get spooled. I mean, I hope I don't lose the fish on the other run. Well, he was spooling pretty good, but he looks weak sauce. Yeah, exactly. It's, it's dangerous. It's human excrement. It's acidic, all your unwanted... You know, stuff's there. Um, I mean, you can make use of it by just borrowing. Like, I think it was Les Stout or someone who showed it. You can use it to, like, uh, condensate the fresh, you know, safe, edible, liquid, potable water out of it. You'd never drink it. There you go, Equalize also there. Gonna reel the other fish in because we got. Oh no, guys! That 20 or whatever minute fight was a waste because I lost the fish. No, I shouldn't have done that. I think it's very, very last thing just before you die. I guess. Damn it, I shouldn't have put the rod down. Why did I listen to you guys? You guys always screw me up. <laughs> the pr 
trust Mr. Nod. Man, I wasted so much time on that fish. Wolf, I afford you. Yes, he did. Damn it, Wolf. No. Man, that sucks. Oh, well. Now we got this turbo fish. No, Wolf is the one who made this game. We're just saying he's the one who... No, not with the screaming and biting, okay? I'm not a toddler. Do you think it's worth waiting? In the depths of cold river like a sturgeon. What? I have been deceived. How could this be? Man, that's... That's a double slap to the face. You know, you, you, you think you're biting on something real. First of all, it's fake. And second of all, you get hooked by this... This tall thing outside of the water. The smelly human or whatever the hell it's called. I like Fisher, but I play rarely. I mean, I kicked it from club. Not a big deal. Yeah, if you're not that active, then I mean, you're gonna get kicked from the clubs. But yeah, I used to play this game all the time. I used to stream this game every week uh, until I hit level 31. Now I need to be level 34 to get to the next map. I've already experienced everything in the game, so it's like, well, what do I do now? Right? Like, I need to grind, obviously, to level 34, but, like, it's kind of, you know, boring. <laughs> That's the issue. That's what I was saying. I wish I could just contact Wolf. And I'd be like, hey, could you please uh, level up my account to level 34? I can check out the other map. Is your online? You have uh, 1 million from level 38. And Marion, you got everything. Okay. No longer am I waiting for Shaffer Larva in the depths. Deep river. No one's asking, do you know where the Shamayas are? Unfortunately, I have no idea where any fish are. Pretty much clueless. Alright, so sadly we wasted a lot of time on the other one. We are not going to put this rod down. All the way right from spawn near the sheds is a nice spot. Wow, someone actually replied. So I play a game all day every day. Yes, you do. Are you retired or something? Or do you just not go to school? Or like, what's your story? Or are you just filthy rich? That you don't need to work single day of your life. Davis, oh, would I have extractive experience 1500? Should I use it or should I put it in the auction for 400? Um, what's harder for you? Gaining experience or gaining money? Whichever is harder for you, use it for that. You don't go to school. Oh, you're too young for school. Is that it? Or are you just not going to school because of the virus? So if, it's, if it takes you less time to make 400 coins, then use it for experience. If it takes you more time to gain at 1500 XP. Or, wait, did I just say it the opposite way? You know what I mean. Oh no, it's becoming nighttime again. Wow. Oh, so are you homeschooled or what's going on here? Now you're 15 the last time you were in school was four years ago almost. That's crazy. You hate e-lessons. I think it's the fact that he's a tad bit too old for school.
it's very interesting. Very interesting due to COVID. How schooling have evolved to online classes. You know, it's really interesting. You know, if I used it... Alrighty, Surge. How much longer are you gonna take? Um... I don't know guys, I, I'm thinking I'll stream for another half hour and that's gonna be it. What do you guys think? Money is kinda easy, hard. I used it, perfect. Alright Evis, there you go, I may, see I helped to make your mind. Money is easy, money is hard for me right now. So I'm hoping, like, if... I can put something in the auction house for like 200 or 300 silver and you buy it and that'll help me a lot. When KG Adam. Hi, how's it going? Welcome to the stream. Ariane, a 10 KG fish. No. Are you talking about this fish I have or the one you got? Okay, let's... What is this fish doing? He's just playing around right now. Guys, please don't forget to hit the like button. If you're enjoying the stream, if you just joined us. Uh, don't forget to say hi, don't be shy. Only Marianne and Jovan's spiders bite. Everyone else is very friendly and nice. Uh, Uzil Perez. Welcome, welcome to the community. Thank you for subscribing. Really hope you enjoy your time here. Uh, I don't know if you uh, subscribed on the stream or if you've subscribed on the channel and you're not watching the stream. Uh, but I'm just looking at my phone. It's telling me that you just subscribed. So Barely a atom. Two of my cats are pregnant. That's great. Wow, Trophy Caspian Salmon someone just got. Damn. How is the hunt going? It's going good. We have a few decent sized sturge. My biggest sturge so far is 30 kg. And that's still a very nice size because it takes a while. I have two warehouse tokens to improve warehouse, but how... Do you do it? I have no idea. Warehouse token? I don't even know what that is, Evis. What's a warehouse? What does it do? Uh, Adam, how's life been going for you? How is your Friday going? Welcome to the stream, everyone. You're just joining us. Uh, we almost seem to have this fish here. I've been fighting for I don't know how long. We did lose a really nice fish. That's fine. I will turn my flashlight on in a in a little bit. How do fish even exist? Wouldn't base it at something you're gonna have to think while uh, while you're in bed, I guess. I'm just waiting to fall asleep. Uh oh, we're getting a bite on the other one. So we almost got this guy here. Man, right on time! Oh wow. He doesn't look too big. Come on, that's a... Dari? That's not a story. Oh, come on. Stop being so stubborn. The Ryuga. Oh, the Huso, right? Can they just fill water with bottle and wait a few decades? Oh my god, what the hell? What was that? 
Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. 31 kg large starry, heck yes. That's our second 30 kg fish. Oh man. Whoso is uh, Beluga? Oh. Alright, what do we have here? It's a small fish, but... Those carps today I made at like 200. Oh my god. Thank you, Jess. So, Evis, you have a lot of money, right? So, can you like donate three, four hundred? Money to me, please. I will uh, post some item <laughs> on the marketplace. You have 734. No, it's okay, Evis. I will tell you how. Let me catch this fish and I'll share my Discord. Yes, I am begging for donations in Adam Fishing 2 because I don't want to die in that game. <laughs> oh, that sounds so funny. I mean it, guys. I'm actually going to die in that game. My character is. I only have one or two more med kits that will last me a little bit. I only have enough money to buy one more med kit and that's pretty much it. I have a good fish in a fishing planet. All the best. I hope to catch the fish. Scream at it. No. Oh, you're talking to Marianne? <laughs> I'm sure he is. I'm sure he's uh, screaming. And... Uh, hey, small fish. 10 kg, please. And 11 kg. Okay. Alright, so let me just go into Discord and, uh... 17 likes. Thank you so much for the likes, guys. Copied. Let's go ahead here. So that is it. Mr. H1N1. Ashish tag 6323. Um, I was extremely frustrated. The bite pikes. <laughs> That's a good business. All right, let's go back to our hole here. Oh no, our uh, our bag is almost filled. So maybe one more fish and our bag will be full. Bite pike. I scream at games all dog. All day, what? All day. Oh, that's funny. Alright, so. Uh, this trip, I'm very happy. Man, this spot is the best. Uh, this spot's the best, seriously. Like, look at this. We have 21 kg sturge, we have 18 kg huso, 30 kg starry sturge, 31 kg starry sturge. 11 kg sturge and another probably 20 kg sturge that got away. Listen to your commands. That is very intelligent fish. Okay. And we get another one. Uh, Donnie, a fish runner. Welcome to the community. Welcome, welcome. How are you? Thank you. Welcome to the community. I'm so happy we're getting so many subscribers here today. I don't know if this is for on stream or if uh, someone's, you know, just watching our video and they decided to subscribe. If you have subscribed and you're on stream, uh, just say hi in the chat. Don't worry, we're not going to bite. <laughs> Is your hair shop, what? 17 likes, thank you. Uh, friend request. Wait, what? Ah, oh, pending. Evis, accept. Okay. I will send you a message, I guess. 
Johnny, yes, there we go. Welcome. Thank you so much. Um, I really hope you've been enjoying the stream. I do play uh, mostly fishing games. That's very popular on the channel, but I love playing other indie games. And checking out different stuff. So hope uh, hope you can find some content that you like. I just released a video of Subnautica today. Ouch. That is... That's not good. Uh, seven seconds watched. Average view time. <laughs> it was... It's up two months ago. Oh, man. Yes. Stopped. And you've been an active part of our community. Thank you for being active. And, uh, yeah. I'll add you to my friend list on Discord. Uh, okay. I'm not sure what I'm gonna do with all of you guys as friends. But... Uh, when did I sub? I cannot remember. When basically you've been with us for a while. Marianne, a 55 kg tarpon you just caught. Wow, nice. Jess has been, I think, the OG. Uh, she's been here for a very long time. SR Bistro has been here for a very long time. Aman has been here for a very long time. There's so many members who've been here from the very beginning. Unfortunately, a few of those members are not really that much active, I guess. Uh, but they do come from time to time. Yeah, I played a little bit of Subnautica. I enjoyed it so much. Oh my god, it's such a pretty game. Okay. Your best is 68 KD Tarpon. Nice. Yeah, I really hope... Uh, I really hope out of the, you know, 868 subscribers that we have here community we have people more people decide to check out other videos besides russian fishing 4 because russian fishing 4 is basically what most of the people are watching uh so it's it's tough uh jess i have a fear of oceans in real life and uh, this game was really scary for me sometimes oh man that was a real challenge for you oceans i mean look it's trippy as heck when you're in deep waters and you don't know what's underneath the water that's scary and i have been to mexico i was um i was uh what do you call it not scuba diving but you have your mask on and there's a pipe going into out of the water into the air so you can breathe um what's it called guys come on i can't that name has escaped my mind uh, not scuba. Scuba is hardcore. Scuba is with the tanks. This is, uh, damn it, I don't remember the name. But basically, guys, uh, I was in Mexico. Um, I was checking out the coral reefs there. And we just left the shore. We swam, we swam. We were looking underwater. And after a while, um, the water got, I, I guess it got about 8 to 10 meters deep. And it is so scary because as soon as you have the wrong thoughts come into your mind, like, oh my God, what if? Snorkeling. Yes, Donnie. Thank you. Snorkeling. I was snorkeling with my brother. And the thought crossed my mind that, oh, this is so deep. What if I cannot swim? Or what if I, uh, I need help? I cannot... Like, I cannot step my foot on ground. There is no ground here. It's like 10 meters below. And when you start thinking like that, it screws you up hard. You start freaking out. Then you're going to start splashing around. And then you're going to drown. It's so all of my life. I've done a lot of swimming. I love swimming pools. And, uh, you know, I'm a seasoned swimmer. But at no time in my life did I ever think, Oh, this is so deep. My feet cannot touch the bottom. Uh, so, <laughs> yeah, it is, it is scary. And guys, I will read your messages. Just give me a second. Oh, wow. 
Okay, we have this guy. 11 kg. Man, this guy's just taking out line. Um, I don't know, but I love my Gmail foot I made with my hands. I'm from Google. Made a logo marker program in my phone. Cool. Only 2% of the ocean was discovered to be ready for more. Huh? I also have a terrible fear of oceans. Okay, guys, I gotta... I gotta turn this around here. Imagine having four hands. Oh, I know someone. Joven. <laughs> yeah. That, uh... The world would be a different place if we all had four hands. We would swim faster. We would probably be running on our six limbs. Rather than just on our feet. Mortal combat would be very interesting. <laughs> um, mostly started when I saw not a good video. My brain. I got really attacked by shark on shore. Ouch. Can't find you on Discord, but okay. It's fine. Oh wow, we already have a fish on our other bottom setup. I think. Man, it's such an interesting talk we're having. See, I saw Jaws when I was a child. That didn't scare me at all or anything. And I used to go, uh... Like, we used to live in Dubai. And I used to go to the shore all the time. Like, on Fridays, my brother and I, we were like, Oh, we want to go to the beach, and our parents would take us there. And uh, even though we didn't know swimming at that time, we were so young. We used to still chill out at the shore, like chill in the water and stuff. So, I could write easier now that I have fish. I do not mean to put it in a way to... What? Alright, you guys gotta like stop being weird, okay? <laughs> uh, this fish... Not very big. By the looks of it, it might fill up our bag, I'm not sure. Uh, but you know what, it's been, it's been a good fishing trip. Have I made enough money to make it back to even break even? No. A uh, piece of mollusks are like, what, 170 silver per mollusk piece? So probably not. Ooh, isn't there... A sh it, doesn't the ship sturgeon bite on a uh, live bait? Ooh. Maybe someday we can do that too. Ship sturgeon bites only in a river. Yeah, the ship, sh ship sturge uh, I've only caught by the island. You have another one, Evis? Damn. Make that money. Because I need it. <laughs> uh, Joven, you have a casting rod. That is great. Good work, Evis. You're killing it in that game. Sturge is sort of strong. It's probably bigger than I thought. Which is good. Is it 30 kg? Is it 40 kg? It's 25 kg. Uh, it all depends how long uh, I fight this fish. Grind, grind, grind. 10 kg. Okay, Marion. Thank you. Thank you for your optimism. Yeah, I think this is going to be our last fish, guys, for the stream. One gram. Yes. 
one gram indeed. Come on, are you tired? I think you're tired. I think you're tired. Hey, you like grind, grind likes you. Perfect. <laughs> that is basically the definition of a free to play game. Grind, grind, grind. One gram, oh boy. Of course. Of course it's one gram. Oh, I forgot we have another fish on our other rod. Okay. What do you got? What do you got? You got. Hmm. Still running. So this guy might fill up our net. Oh, it's still fighting for you. 124 of 150 kg. Okay, what the hell, fish? Ooh. That boat went underwater for a second. I was watching a PC and I switched to mobile. I have 144p, wanted to change to higher. Notice the GUI. I changed the resolution, it changed a lot. Is on mobile. Okie dokes. Yeah, you 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 want to see more than just ten pixels. I can understand. Fully update. <laughs> Come on, this fish is not giving up. Which is good. I mean, it's a biggie. DUI. You're watching in 360p, okay. Well, you're also playing an online game, so I guess you need upload for that. I up to break, it's still not giving up. Uh oh. Evis is gonna get spooled. Yeah, your internet is always playing games. Your internet plays more games than you do. <laughs> By the sounds of it. Oh, man. Damn, someone just got a trophy, Woga Xander. Man, how are people catching trophies left and right in this game? And I'm not. What am I doing wrong? Is it... Is it because of you guys? I think it doesn't like your streams. Yeah. Your fish is chilling out at 30 meters out. I think your fish is stuck. Or maybe it's tired. Like, well, I ran the much as, as much as I could. Ooh, I want to know how and where to catch the Volgas. Am I try Adam Fishing 2? Do you think it will be worth it? Well, Adam Fishing 2 is free to play. Uh, so it costs absolutely nothing. It's up to you if you're willing to be patient and whatnot. Not everyone game. Like, not everyone likes the survival aspect. I know Jess said she didn't. So it might throw you off. It is a slow game in the beginning. You will be catching tiny fish on tiny setups for a few hours, for many hours. But 
it is still fun. Like, I'm enjoying it. And I would have never played this game had you guys not suggested it, one thing. And the second thing, had people not watched the video. Like, so many people watched the video. Over 100 people watched almost every episode, which is insane. <laughs> so that's why I just love playing the game. One grand fish giving you a fight. I know, right? The setup I have is like half a, half a gram. Martin, welcome back. I thought you were gone for good. Yeah, of course agree with him. Such a, such a positive community here. Okay, Ivis, you're bringing him in. He's like, what, 29.5 meters out. Uh, you know what? At least you're not going to get spooled, so that's great. And this guy is not tiring out. So this might be our biggest fish of the day. Our biggest fish right now is, I believe, 32 kg. Gonna increase the speed of the bow because this guy is nowhere close to slowing down. One grand fish don't get tired on awful setups. Ah, oh, yes, of course. Of course. Full speed ahead. Come on, dude. Man, I want a 100 kg sturgeon in RF4. Or a 100 kg catfish. My biggest fish right now in that game is 55 kg. Can you believe that? I don't like I got the 55 kg sturge I think October of last year in 2020 and at that time you know I was still low level and it was just such an accomplishment for someone that, that low level but now I'm over 700 hours in and uh, it's not good enough 55 kg for someone with that many hours is not good enough not for me I need to catch a bigger fish Maybe this fish is tired. I don't know. I feel like it is. Okay, I'm gonna stop boat. Please give up. Resistance is futile. Okay, we still have him close by. I'm gonna reverse a little bit here. I think he's almost surfacing, guys. Oh, yeah, there we go. I think that might be a story. I saw that pointy nose. Ooh, yes, what the heck did you get? You got a trophy, didn't you? 
Okay, and uh, no, that looks like a regular Sturge. 37 kg large sturgeon. All right, so that's going to be our biggest fish of the day. Unfortunately, nothing over, you know, 40 kg or anything like that. No big fish. Uh, so guys, honestly, um, ground bait is a huge disappointment. Hey, it is bigger than one gram. <laughs> Uh, yeah, ground bait, huge disappointment, especially how extremely expensive this is to make. Uh, mollusk pieces, mussels, this is exactly what Sturge like. And unfortunately, I feel like even without ground bait, I would have still got all these guys. So that was an experiment I wanted to try on the stream. And I feel like with proven that it doesn't work i could be wrong someone more educated could probably tell me i don't know uh but this spot however is amazing look at this 21 kg 18 kg 30 kg 31 kg 11 11 and 37 kg search uh that is absolutely amazing let's go back to the shop here and see how much we've earned Uh, 1,200 silver. Nice. So today I made 1,000, no, 2,300 silver. From these Sturge. Did I even break even? I really don't know. Bunch of clams, very expensive. 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Oh, no, I did not. Bunch of clams alone costed me 1,200 silver. I used one, two, three, four, five, six bunches of clams. Six times six, ta six times a hundred and sixty-three silver, and uh, you will know how much bunches of clams that costed me. Thank you, everyone. Look at that, one thousand two hundred. I asked in the chat, can you target Woga, Xander? How to? Catch them. Wooga Xander. How do you catch Wooga Xander? Where are they? Uh, Wooga Xander, Jig, Twist, Nor 2. There's a YouTube channel you know how to catch. Well, that doesn't help me because I'm not going to watch it on stream. If I remember correctly, you could use small hooks and catch a lot of bait fish here. How many bait fish do I have? Oh wow, 75 bait fish? Someone gifted me these bait fish, I know it. I cannot catch 75 on my own. We need sea life bait though. So, fishing rods. Take this out. Let's and what are we going to use here? Small hooks, I think. And... Guys, what do you use here? I forgot. Horn. Fish pieces. Larva beak. I'm close to level 32. Yes, thank you. Oh my god, I've been stuck at level 31. 47,000, no, 473,137. We need 474,000. Um, hold on. Let me see what we catch. Fish pieces, peeled. Fish pieces. So fish pieces is what we need here. Fishy PC. There's fish pieces. There we go. Mm. Ooh. 
Uh, Evis, two times 20 kg carbs. I think I'm done. Bye, I'll see you. Evis, Marianne, thank you so much for being a part of the stream. I will see you guys hopefully tomorrow. Bye, guys. Look at that, guys. He helped me. Go to... Uh, wait, what was I asking for? Volga. Volga Xander. Oh, WTF. Are you going to? No, I'm not leaving, guys. Wait, what's going on? Oh, you guys are telling... Oh, okay, okay. You're saying bye to Marianne and Evis. For a second, I'm like, hold on. I am not ending the stream just yet. Oh, no. I was just saying bye-bye to Marianne and Evis. Uh, go to A10, which is 127, 173. Use a casting rod, a jig, 1 to 5 grams, and twist Nord. Twist. Twist. Oh, you were saying bye to Evis as well. Okay. My bad. <laughs> Big confusion. Yeah. Viewers watching your stream. Zero. Everyone left. What? I'm still streaming. Um, I'm gonna stay. I'm gonna try these Volga Xanders, guys. Deep in the deep area. Northeast and southwest. Thank you. So much for the details. Going there now. Hey, stop walking. Um, nice. Oh my god. Uh, what? Yep, I'm gonna stay for a little bit, guys. So, we are just gonna use our <laughs> 52 kg bait caster for these measly little sanders. Sorry, uh, Woga sanders. Twist Nord 1. I guess Volga Xanders are gonna take size 1, which is small, and then Twist Nord 1. And I think that should do it. Uh, he says he catches them day and night. A10. Where is A10? A. Oh my god, A10 is so close. And you know what? We can take this rust bucket here. Thanks again. Oh my god, someone helped me. I'm so happy. Look at this. We are driving at this hunk of boat. Uh, Evis, by the way, I forgot. Thanks for stream. I'm really going to go. Aw, thank you, Evis. See you tomorrow. Have a great Saturday. Wait, today's Friday, right? Yes. Have a great Saturday. I'll see you tomorrow. I made a live. I made a lot of sense. <laughs> A10. So somewhere A10, he said a deep part of A10. Northeast. How do you know which way Northeast is? Let me read this screenshot again. Um, I catch them all day and night. Doesn't matter. Uh, A10. Use casting rod. Deep area northeast and southwest. 127, 173. Wait, what? Uh, 127, 173. One twenty seven, one seventy three, one twenty five, one twenty seven, one seventy three, one. And where is this place? Twenty seven. Oh, one twenty four, one seventy three, one twenty seven, one seven three.
Uh, one baser, you're gonna leave as well. One baser, thank you so much for being a part of the stream. I really appreciate it, and I will hopefully see you tomorrow. Have a great night. Have a great rest. One twenty-seven, one seventy-three. All right, one baser. It says bye, chat. In the, between the island. Yeah, we are in between the island. Somewhere over here. Uh, this is literally the deep part that I'm uh, at. Oh, our leader is 43 kg. I don't know if Volga Xanders are going to bite on that. A good spot for Volgas. Cool. Yeah, I think I'm gonna downgrade the leader from 43 kg to like 15 kg. I don't know if that makes a difference. You know what? I should throw out uh, other things too. Bottom feeding setups. While you guys are fishing for Volga Xanders here, do you like throw out bottom fishing? Feeder setups too. 4.5 kg I got. Alright, we got a 4.5 kg leader. The guide to Nord 1. We get random uh, wild carps here. Ooh, maybe we can use the nut cake to get him. The brownie, as I call it. Okay, that should be the deeper end. Have we tried the depth barge? No. What is that? I guess I equip it on my character and then it tells me the depth, I guess. I know with bottom setups, when you throw it and it touches the bottom, it tells you what the depth is. Oh, what? Depth charge as in literally a grenade. Is that what you're talking about? <laughs> Hold on, let me put out... Let me put out... Uh... Rempel medium. No. Big, we need nut. I don't know if this is going to help us. Uh, but whatever. Let's give it a shot. For a second, I'm like, what? Is that something that tells you the depth? Or. Alright, well, these Volga Xanders are. Being a little stubborn here. See here, Shemaya, Volga Sanders, nothing for that. Yeah, depth charge is definitely gonna bring, a, bring us a lot of fish. And some sushi, probably, as well. And bits and stuff. So he said Twist Nord 1 or a 1 to 5 gram jig. Oh, yes. There we go. Noise. Nice. Wait, what the heck is that? That's not a Wogo Xander. Oh, that is a Wogo Xander. 1.1 kg. And we are level 32. Yay! Man, what the heck? 
We gotta go two more levels to, uh, to Scotland. The Loch Ness Monster. Advice, don't use leader. Why not? I have a 51 kg line. Thank you so much. Why shouldn't I use a leader? I have to because I'm targeting Boga Zanders, the tiny fish, so I need a tiny leader. Nice, that was a large Boga Zander. Even, you know, unfortunately, uh, the small fish in this game are absolutely worthless. And he should, ma he, he should make them worth more. Especially if they're rare fish. And I thought this wasn't going to work. I thought I would have had to buy some jig. This game isn't same realistic as RF4. I've caught large Wokazander without a leader. I mean, if I can keep catching as many Wokazanders without leaders, then of course I'm willing to do it. I'm just using a leader because... I don't know. Maybe he has implemented a system where smaller fish... Will, won't bite on big lines. I can take the leader off. Whatever, let's give it a shot. Also, watch it. There is Xander there, I think. Regular Xanders? Oh, that will wreck face but i don't see any of these guys catching any big fish though try a setup with a uh, bait fish wayne hello wait were you here from before oh you just came on i'm so sorry martin has a blue uh like a profile picture and yours is blue as well i mistook you i'm so sorry wayne welcome to the stream Um, try to set up with bait fish. Okay, so we're going to throw this guy out. Put this guy in. Can we do bait fish? Man, these hooks are so big, we can't, even, we can't even put bait fish on. Big hooks, bait fish, and yeah. Why isn't this working here? Uh, okay. Try size 2 hook or 1 because they're small fish. Oh, I did not know Boga Xander, which is tiny fish, literally eat tiny bait fish. Like this bait fish as big as Boga Xander. I thought you're telling me to go after big fish while I'm at it here. Um, but I guess I'll give it a shot. All right, Wogi Zandi. I'm gonna throw you here because this is the deep end. This is the deep end. That's the deep end. All right, Marianne. Thank you so much for being a part of the stream. Have a great night. See you tomorrow. Bye. Try a two size hook. Okay. Cool. So I. Oh, not again. Put it back. Alright, so we have the nut the brownie cake for the wilds, if there are any here. Uh, we have bait fish hair on the tiny hook. And we have our spinner. And uh, let's let's see what we can get here. We have one large Volga. Volga Sander. And he looks funny. Face looks a little weird. And guys, just I don't know, maybe another Boga Sander or two, and gonna be it for the stream. I really thought these. Oh, there we go. I really thought they were a lot easier to catch. Boga Xander, nice.
Nice. I'm happy. I'm happy we're catching these things, even though they're absolutely worthless. Oh, right off the bat. Got a face <laughs> <laughs> oh man. <laughs> uh, I'm not even gonna say it. <laughs> 685 grams. So, yeah. You know what? You guys are right. Leaders, I guess this doesn't matter. I have a 51 kg line. Uh, Martin, biggest Wolga Zander in game is 2 kg and 2.57 grams. I mean, I don't know these fish in real life. I've never heard of them before. So I don't even know if that's an extremely large unrealistic size or it's just a big size in comparison to their real life counterpart. That fish is going to vomit. Ew. Owen, what the heck? That's so random. We have another Wogazander. Nice. 1.388 large Wogazander. I wonder if the XP I'm getting, oh, 1200, is almost as much as, uh, it's almost as much as the Sturge that we're giving us. Wolgazand is smaller than Sander. Yes, you're absolutely right. Uh, because the regular Xanders we've been catching have been in the 20 kg range. And I'm happy we actually Got to a spot and it's actually working. We're actually targeting like a specific fish. Let's see if our bottom fishing setups get it. In Europe, Xander is popular fish food or food fish. Cool. The majority of these fish are like from Asia or from the Europe and Russian area. I think the majority of them I haven't heard their names before and I know I know a lot of them do exist in North America too but 626 grand yeah it's a very long face I feel like this might be a little bit off unless in real life they do look this derpy <laughs> uh, but their skin it looks so rough uh, still no fish on the bottoms I do catch Xander on a red trout spinner. But what is a red trout spinner? Oh, the, the lure. Okay, 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 okay. Yeah, I saw the red trout spinner in... Uh, on the weeklies. Big! Hello, so good to see you after such a long time. What have you been up to? Have you been catching trophies? Have you been catching trophies in Fisher Online? Red Trout Spinner. I don't think I have that. Let me just check. Misc spinning. Red Trout Spinner. You have Trout Master. I guess I don't have that. But it's still fine because we're catching them. No trophies. But at least have been enjoying this game though. There's so many people catching trophies. Mostly been playing VR. What is VR? Virtual reality? That's... Ooh! Interesting! Nice! You have a headset now, huh? I still don't have any fish on the bottoms. Look at big Mr. High Roller here. Oh no, frost warning. What the hell? I don't want a frost warning again. Oh, this cold won't leave us alone, guys. I perch all fish. A red trout master. Patches, pike, perch, all fish in Scotland. I think Scotland or is the place I've not caught a single fish at, right? Hold on. Poland. France, Italy. Uh, Finland. Germany. 
Netherland. Ah, Netherland is the place I've never caught a single fish at. I just don't understand what Netherland is about. Um, red trout catches pike perch all fish in Scotland. See, uh, <laughs> I really want to go Scotland, but I got two more levels. That's going to take too long. I am just looking at my phone. Give me a moment, guys. something got something okay I am back what do we have here 1.2 kg Voga Xander. Guys, one more Xander and that's going to be it. Alrighty. Let's hope this one's a trophy. Where are you going next? What do you mean? Uh, I was fishing for sturge today i made special sturge ground bait <clears throat> and uh we made what 2400 silver in two hours <coughs> and that's gonna be it i don't know where to go next because i need two more levels before i go to a new map use peas and shrimp in the netherlands Peas and shrimp. And cast just anywhere, cast in the deep end. Because I went there twice, people said try this, try that, and it just didn't work. Oh wow, look at that. The guy got a trophy Shemaya. Where is this Shemaya? I want to go for that. Man, everyone's catching trophies so easily. What the heck? Uh, swim 170 upwards. Huh? Um, go and drink the drink of coffee once. You can unlock maximum energy. Nice. Uh... On, come on hurry up give me that one sander and we can go sell them and see how it is yeah let's see when we get the trophy how many more hours before we get another trophy uh but the xanders very interesting i'm happy i found the spot 170 okay because I know in that place, in, uh, whatever that map is, I forgot its name already. Uh, the deep part of the river is where you cast usually, I guess. Hey, finally we got something. Alrighty. 
Here's another Volga Sander 1.234. So we've caught 1.179, 1 1.1, 1 1.38, 1 1.2, 1 1.2, 1 1.17. 1 1.388 is our biggest. Let's see what the record is right now. Volga Sander 2.2 by Kelroy. Alright, let's go ahead and sell these fishies and uh, conclude the stream. Uh, 162. You know what? These are decent money because they're very easy to catch. They don't cost anything. You don't have to go bottom fishing for these guys. Um, they're not too slow of a fishing. Head, hello, welcome to the stream. Wow. Uh, that area you can catch pike, catfish, ship, sturge. Um, there nightfish, sander, Wayne says. Yeah, someone in the in-game chat was like, oh, I cast them all day long. But I know from RF4, Voga Sanders and Sanders. At least Voga Sanders, I guess, fight at night. Uh, Ted. For catfish, I guess... I will, I mean, how do you catch the catfish? Serge and I know bunches of clam. How do you catch Amur Black? That is my bigger question. How do you catch the catfish? Do you just throw a bunch of giblets there and see? Because you know what, guys? I am finally, I have an idea of recording an episode here. And I'm going to go for the Voga Xanders. I'm going to tell people what you need, how you do it. And then I'm going to try other fish too at this spot. So, cats. Uh, are there ummers here? Oh my god, there are ummers here. They're on Technoplankton. Uh... Okay, guys, you have piqued my interest. Uh, giblets will work. Ummers will work on green boilies and algae. Thank you so much, Ted. Oh my god. I cannot wait to do this. Uh, algae. What is algae? I don't remember. Uh, baits. Oh, this is algae. I've never used algae before. Wow. I feel algae is a rare thing. Go into algae. Actually, algae is really cheap. <laughs> All right. Uh, unfortunately, guys, this is going to be it for the stream today. I'm so happy I'm seeing so many new faces. Ted, thank you so much. Wayne, thank you for your help. Uh, craft it. Before I end the stream, you know what? Let me see. How do you craft this? I wanna, I wanna figure this out. Craft. Crafting table. Algae. Ah, oh, with these. Okay, so I did craft. Bunch algae. Interesting. Twenty pieces of algae. There we go. Thank you so much for that. I need giblets. Let's make giblets here. One P. In case I do go for catfish again. Ooh. There we go. And green boilies. Okay, we do have cabbage and stuff like that. All right. Uh, once again, thank you all. For being a part of the stream thank you so much guys ted wayne jess uh all of you who have helped me in this game and um i will be streaming the same time tomorrow 1 p.m eastern standard time canadian i don't know what time that will be in europe uh, but i will be uh playing russian fishing 4 like i always say i'll either get my butt kicked by that game or i'll kick the game's butt by catching trophies who knows tomorrow's a new day a new fishing day so uh enjoy your night guys i really hope 
Enjoy the rest of your Saturday. And uh, I will see you tomorrow. Bye, everyone. Stay safe out there.